Sean May here for Go Hills TV, joined by Bryce Johnson. Bryce, as we look back at the Florida State game, what was it? Um, when did you realize that they couldn't stop you that night? In the beginning of the second half, uh, they kind of went on a run, and then I think somebody said I went on a shot like May 4, four in a row or something like that, and I mean, they were all layups, so it's, it's just kind of when I knew, and then all of a sudden, it just kept going. You know, you had crazy numbers, 39 and 23. Wish you would have got 24, so we have more to talk about. But 39 and 23, when do you realize? Is it do you ever step out of the moment and realize the numbers that you had, or are you just in the moment and just playing? I just kind of stay in the moment uh, throughout the game. I mean, that's been one of my goals all season, just get more than 20 rebounds. And I mean, you said you at one point you told me where you had 24 rebounds, and you know, once I looked up and I saw I had 23, I was like, well, maybe I can get one or two more so I can beat you, but. It didn't happen, so I mean, it's, just, it's still just an honor just to be able to help my team out that way and be able to break a few records. As we look back through your career, you seem like you've gotten a lot bigger, a lot more size. How important has the strength and conditioning part of it been for you and your development over the last four years? It's been a great deal, I mean, just because uh, when I first got here, I played a lot of the five with James Michael still being here, and, and there was a lot of guys that were a lot bigger than me, so it was, it was a size advantage for them, and just I just need to get a lot bigger. I mean, I was the size of a point guard at the time I got here I was about 187 pounds and now I'm at 225 so it really helped me in a great deal just being a lot bigger and being able to hold my own down in the post. You, Marcus, Joel came in together. We don't see that a lot uh, in college basketball anymore with the one and dones guys staying all four years. You guys started something being able to finish it and hopefully having a chance to win. Talk about how important that is in the relationship you guys have developed. Since the first day we've been on campus I mean we've been like brothers. I mean, it's, been a great ride with those guys and I mean wish it wouldn't come to an end and I mean, it's been a lot of fun but it, it would mean a lot for us to just win something since we've been here I mean this year just because I mean we've had the ACC championship stripped from us twice since we've been here and I mean we want to be able to hang a banner I mean that's the reason you come here you want to be able to hang a banner and become a part of this history because I mean this is a great history of basketball and I mean it's, why wouldn't you want to be in that in that history book? Talk about how Coach Williams and the staff has been instrumental in your development, your skill development, being able to score the ball in a multitude of different ways, and uh, over the course of your four years, being able to expand your game a little bit. The biggest thing that was an issue for me was just my size, I and mean, I wasn't the biggest guy, so Coach always emphasizes about us posting up lower, and I mean, I just had, didn't have the size and, and the strength to do it. So, I mean, that was just. The biggest thing that I needed to work on was just getting a little stronger so that I could post up a little lower because I mean I can really score the ball down low. It's just I need to get better positions sometimes to be able to get those easy shots. This is obviously an academically tough school. Uh, being here four years, going on to graduate. Talk about how important the academic side of it was for you being a student athlete at the University of North Carolina. Uh, it was very important being a student athlete here. I mean, just having my parents as teachers has always been a one thing that I've paid attention to a lot, and I mean it's. It's just great just to be here. I mean, I didn't think I'd end up here academically or just basketball-wise. It's just it's an honor to be here. I mean, you do have you do have to put in a lot of work here because I mean, teachers do have a do have a target on your back because you do play basketball and they, they do see you in that limelight. So I mean, you just you just got to come in here with a mindset that you are going to be worked very hard and just have to be ready to face adversity because I mean, there's a lot of adversity that comes with it. When you look at um, your time here over the past four years. What's Bryce Johnson going to miss most about North Carolina? Just putting on the jersey. I mean, just being able to run out of the tunnel and seeing 22,000 people in the stands, and I mean, it's just a lot of fun. Just being able to play here has, has been an honor. Just just knowing the greats that have been here, like yourself, I mean, you're, you're in the Raptors, and I mean, with Michael Jordan being in the Raptors, just playing here is just it's an honor to be here. And I mean, I don't want to I don't want to be able to say that I took it for granted. Just want to be able to say that. I did what I needed to do and I mean I did have a lot of fun doing it.